How do I know if I need a financial planner? Everyone needs a financial planner. Uh, everyone. Some, everyone. Some people need a financial planner more than others, uh, but everyone needs a financial planner. Can you make me a millionaire? Sure. <laughs> yeah. <Wow. laughs> Let's do it. There's not. There's not. <laughs> it, it's just math, and it's just you know. Um, of course, you want to invest intelligently, and you want to get rid of waste in your that you have in your life. Waste would be. Am I not? utilizing tax smart saving strategies or am I overpaying for insurance or uh, those types of things but if you save in a in a disciplined manner and I'm not saying like you have to live eat canned tuna every day but if you save and invest intelligently you'll become a millionaire so where should I be in my life uh, in order to start thinking about finding a financial planner as soon as possible and as soon as you get out of school, if you have a financial planner who's helping you at that time, then your plan is going to be that much better. One thing that I'm actually afraid of, of being, is being judged by sharing my finances with someone else. I've always done it privately. Uh, are you gonna laugh at me? I won't laugh at you. If I go to the doctor and show the doctor my medical history, um, the doctor's not gonna laugh at me, he's gonna use that medical history to, to better, you know, help me and advise me on my health and how it can be improved. And that's the same thing that a financial planner is going to do. You know, any experienced professional financial planner is going to be think it's going to have, first of all, seen it all. You know, so you're not going to, to you know, shock them with what's going on with your financial life and you know, what's going, how you're investing money and how you're managing your finances. Um, and, and in fact, I, opening up, and, and showing how you've been managing your finances is gonna reveal a lot about just you and your behavior and your interests. And, and the financial planner, good financial planner is gonna be thinking about you and how to customize the plan to you and your interests and your goals and your personality. How do I go about finding a financial planner? You can, of course, uh, talk to your friends and family, see who they've had a good experience with. Um, you can also go to a couple of places to find a financial planner. One is the National Association of Personal Financial Advisors, NAPFA, uh, which is an organization of fee-only advisors, which means that the advisors who are part of this association do not sell financial products. They do not sell insurance products, banking products, investment products, and take a commission. They get paid just a transparent fee for service. And a lot of people like that way of working because uh, it can reduce conflicts of interest and you, you can feel that the advisor doesn't have an ax to grind. Thanks a lot, Andrew. Pleasure, Andy.